waiting under the tree. Yeah. yeah, it looks like a bass. And they're just the only things biting around here lately. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Good job. Thank you. Closer. Nice chubby fat belly. There you go. Good job. <laughs> So I'm trying this uh, very small lure here that I kind of just whipped up. I usually don't do very good on things like this that I put together myself, but uh, I was getting some bites on a crappy lure from fish over here, and it just seemed to me like they were too small to actually take it, so I thought I'd put something really small on and see if I could get them. And it looks like I can. There you go. Oh, got off. It was a sunfish, though. I think this hook's <laughs> It's too small. <laughs> ah, there you go. That was easy. There we go. Tiny bluegill. Off a worm. All right, well, what we were trying out over there with the worms just wasn't working out. So we are uh, back over here, and I put this uh, this little guy back on. Uh, it's not the triple threat, but it's, like, close enough. Alright, got one. Finally. Don't know I don't think he's eating sized. No, he's not quite big enough. Boy, I got him right oh god, right through like the top of his nose almost his eyes. He'll be alright. Ow. Damn. Oh, got something good. Oh, yeah. It's a bass. Yeah. Nice bass. Caught up in that. Ooh, you mother because of that branch. God damn it. The one I was trying to pull out earlier. That's all it takes to lose him. He wasn't like huge or anything, but. Yeah, I wanted to look at him. He jumped out of the water all nice and everything. This thing's coming out. Yeah, get the shit out of there. I'm also going to rage break and throw it. Damn this is what you get for fucking with the fish dimension. show it. <laughs> It'll teach it to be a stick. That's the fish over there I was trying to catch too. Seems like they want it fairly slow. Huh. Something bit the tail off. I didn't even feel it. Huh. Oh well. One more down. Triple threat's back. Got something good here. This'll do. Another bass. Quit jumping. Ooh, this is a good one. Yeah. Not bad, not bad. Oh, I just barely had him too. Better get away from the water. 
case he pops off. All right, come here, guy. Yeah, he popped off. You're gonna have to settle down. Damn it, that is an effective little method. Killing me, so bending over has been difficult. All right, finally. Oh, I gotta wash him off a second here. If only they knew they're making it that much harder on themselves by uh, thrashing around like that. But nonetheless, nice little bass. Felt bigger uh, when I caught him. And uh, I'm fairly certain that this is probably the same fish I've been uh, catching here over and over again. It's about the same size. And uh, yeah, he's definitely got more than a few holes in his jaw. So uh, say hello again to our little bass that uh, pretty much bites anything it sees over and over again and doesn't learn. All right, let's let him go again. I'm going to start naming that fish. How about a uh, bitey? Bitey. I like it. Great, right into a tree. Knew it! Mother fuck! Hmm. I wonder if this little yellow uh, swim tail will catch anything. Didn't even know we had this, somehow. <laughs> Worth a shot, right? Get on there. I guess that's set up decently enough. All right, let's try this. Put a heavier jig head on. Hopefully it'll help it sink below this uh, friggin' debris that's everywhere. Also helped me cast a lot farther. Yeah. All right, now every time I try to throw over here, I wind up losing my lure. Let's see if I can avoid that this time by not throwing into a tree. There we go, that is finally what I wanted to do. I wanted to get in front of this bush. That's why. Whoa! Yeah. Caught a bigger one. God, I can't believe he was there that whole time. You gotta hold still if you wanna get loose. Damn, he's a big fish. Strong. All right, let's get you free. God damn it, hold still. Sheesh. Fish here are awfully aggressive. All right. Well, this is a slightly better fish, and now I am uh, certain that I'll be doing a video today. <laughs> All right. So he's he feels like he's about um, weighing in at about two pounds. <laughs> nice two pound uh, largemouth bass, and uh, in typical fashion, he was. Uh, sitting right on the shore uh shockingly close to where we've been standing and talking and throwing and cursing and everything all day and uh, i can't believe that that doesn't drive them off sometimes but uh yeah he was just sitting right there and finally i threw in just the right place and i caught him all right i'll show him off to the wife here and then we'll get him back in the water last look at our uh nice little two pound largey here that's, uh, you know, a good fish for me. All right, let's let him go. Well, seems like his jaw is fine. Yeah, there we go. 
and he's gone. Oh, nice. I left my uh, rod all the way back up here. I always had a feeling there's got like, you know, look at that. That's gotta be like bass heaven right there, right? And yet I've never caught one there and finally now I have. And uh, this is what he bit. It seems like they're going, you know, the fish are turning that uh, kind of apricot color. So I put a yellow uh, swim grub on uh, kind of a pretty heavy, um, you know, plain offset hook jig head. And he bit that. Must have liked the way it looked. And uh, you can see he was sitting right here. I've been dragging stuff uh, past here all day, but I guess, you know, with fish sometimes, it's about getting it in just the right spot. I'm seeing sort of a minor feeding frenzy going on over there, so I'm trying to cast past it and reel through it just to see what's, uh, what's doing all the eating over there. Okay, I got something. Something decent. Caught one of those fish that was splashing around over there. It's heavy. Another bass. God. So it's bass again. And this time I'm sure it's not one I've caught before. <laughs> nice. He's bleeding a little. Probably hurt himself uh, jumping into something. Boy, maybe I should be using uh, bass hooks. These little ones are doing some damage here. You have got to hold still, friend, so I can get you free. You're just damaging yourself here. All right, okay, I got him, got him right through the nose, uh, his little nasal area there, so it shouldn't do any permanent damage. Wow, this turned out to be a really good day. Check it out. Another uh, nice, uh, I'd say, two-pound bass again. He actually does look very similar to the last one, but I don't think the last one would have went all the way over there after I let him go. So, uh, yeah, we're looking good. And I don't, I don't see any other holes in his, uh, in his nose or anything either. So, I do believe we have another nice size uh, largemouth here. And this is a uh, flat swamp on uh, High Rock Lake, just another part of it. And he's looking real nice. Happy to catch him. <laughs> I'm actually ecstatic now because we got a really good video. Nice bass. Hey, nice bluegill. We doubled up. Yeah, look at that. There you go. Nice fish. I'd say you caught another uh, eating sized one there too. Yep, yeah, he's going to join his buddy in our tummy. Yep. Yeah. So we might uh, might be eating as well tonight as yeah. catching good fish. Awesome. Good bass. All right. Very good. Nice fish. Yeah. All right. Let's let him go because that's what he wants to do. I love the way bass feel, by the way. They're so uh, nice and silky. All right. There you go, buddy. Go be free. Bubble, 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 bubble. There he goes. Off that way. You, you catch so many... Uh, you catch so many fish here that are of like similar size and and features yeah. that uh, I'm always like wondering if it is if it's the same fish. <laughs> um, probably not because that one was over on the other side. Mm-hmm. There's like two or three of them over there too. I'm throwing at them. Well, that was, you know, that thing you were throwing at where you were trying to get the little feeding frenzy. Yeah. That's where I got them. That ah. that's what's doing that. Yeah, they're feeding up on things that swim too. So uh, anything that swims, jerk bait, lipless crank, uh, and any of uh, swim bait, any of the swimming baits would be doing really good out here right now because they're they're biting things that uh, that swim. If you wanted to come out and uh, actually use bass tackle, I'm not. I'm using my crappy setup because, well, because it's just been working lately. You got to do what works. Ever just be quiet. <laughs>